Do you want to play defenses like a pro in singles? Start doing this defensive mid-court shot. Before we continue with the video, please subscribe to this YouTube channel. We promise you that we will continue to deliver great badminton content every week. Thank you. So having variations in general in badminton is never a bad thing. And that's why I want you to start implementing the mid-court defensive shot in your defense. So what is it exactly? Basically, it's a defensive shot. Let's say my opponent did a smash on me that I'm playing the defensive shot, but I'm not playing it short as I usually would do. I'm actually pushing it quite a bit into the court, a bit flat into the court, almost like a flat defensive uh, shot in doubles. So that's what I want to do is like playing this flat drive into the court. When I play my defensive drive towards the mid court, I'm actually eliminating a few angles from my opponent. They are getting the shot here uh, at the mid court, and it's, I would say, pretty hard to do something very dangerous of playing a, a winner from that position. So they can still play a drive, they can still play a, a drop shot towards the net or in lift, but I'd argue you will have time to cover that shot unless it's, of course, almost a perfect shot from their end. So having this variation pushing your defense into the court, into the mid court, is actually, I would say, an underrated thing. And if you start noticing, a lot of the top players are actually doing it because it's eliminating a lot of dangerous situations. So usually, some would do a smash on me. I do a defensive block. In that block, maybe they're able to move towards the net, do a proper kill. Maybe they're able to do a perfect spin. But with the mid-court situation, they can't really spin, at least. So they can't, like, play this very dangerous spin where I have to lift it or, or even I'm not able to lift it. So try to do this in your defense. But what I want you to focus on, of course, needs still to be careful and don't overuse this. Use it from time to time, getting the shot into the mid court, but not use it always because then if I'm the opponent, I would play a smash and then I'd be ready to really jump towards it uh, on the mid court uh, and then it starts to get dangerous. It's that it's this surprising moment that they are playing a smash and normally they want to focus towards the net and then suddenly they're almost getting it in the face. Uh, that's what I want to do. And that's why you shouldn't overuse this shot. So now we've been through an alternative to your single defense, a shot where you play the, the defensive shot into the mid court. Don't overuse it. Use it from time to time because then you'll be able to surprise your opponent and that might actually turn the defensive situation into an offensive situation. So try it out and uh, let me know how it works. <laughs>